Hi everyone, um, just a quick video today for you, just to explain how to use your Aeroccino from your Nespresso machine. You might have been to the shops and bought one and just wondering how you use this device. Well, the first thing you need to know is that there's two ways that you can use it. The first way is to just spin your milk up without frothing it up too much. And for that you would just use this little device here without the spring on it. If you want to have frothy milk though, then you just take the little spring, you'll see there's a little ridge there and you just pop it on. And then you put it inside, it's a magnetic, a magnetic mechanism and it just pops straight in there. So while we're inside here, you might be able to see there, I'll just get it there, yeah, there's two fill marks there. The bottom one is for if you're using the spring and you want to froth it up, that's the bottom mark, you, you, you fill it to that one, that's your maximum fill level. The second line is if you're not using the spring, you can obviously put more milk in because it's not going to froth up and overflow as much. So there are your two fill lines. So the next thing we do is, um, we'll just pour a little bit of milk in for now. I'm using whole milk and the reason I, I use whole milk is because it froths up so much better than semi-skimmed or skimmed. Um, if you get if you try it with whole milk, you really will notice a big difference. You'll get a, a really good frothed up milk. So we'll just pour a little bit in. We don't need too much. Just pop the lid on. We pop it on here, and I'll just set it off for you now. So it doesn't take too long to do it. About sixty seconds, roughly. Um, this is obviously the time where you would be making your coffee. It's important to get your timings right because obviously if you make your coffee too early then that's going to be going cold or if you set this off too late, you know, you, it's, you've just got to get it just right so that you, this is spinning around and frothing up while you're making your coffee and you're ready to go. So I'll just let that go to the end just to show, prove it takes about 60 seconds and I'll just pour it into this little cup here. And I'll show you the consistency of the milk as it comes out. Just a few more seconds now. Sixty seconds is a long time when you're waiting for it, isn't it? Right, I'm expecting this will be done in a second. Yeah, there we go. So just take it out now and I'll show you how frothy it comes out. Perfect for a cappuccino or a latte. Now there's one more thing I just want to show you. And that is that you can actually use it as well to do cold milk. Before we do that, I'll just tell you that if you're making a few coffees, like if you've got friends around and you're making one after the other, then it's best to just rinse it out between each use. And the reason for that is that if you keep using it with hot milk, it can start to burn milk onto the inside of the Aeroccino. And we don't want that, you know, you don't want to ruin your Aeroccino. They're not cheap, they're about £50 to replace. Um, but, you know, as, I'm just gonna, as a demonstration, I'll just show you the cold milk bit and then I'll wash it out. So to get it to spin up cold milk instead of hot milk, you just hold this button here for five seconds and it'll come up blue and then it'll start mixing your cold milk. But... We'll, we'll finish the video after this, so I'll just press it for five seconds. As you can see, it's gone blue, and that will now be for cold milk. So I'll just take that off. I hope that you found that useful, and you now know how to use your Aeroccino. We've got loads more videos, Nespresso videos, on our channel page. You know, so like and subscribe. If you've liked the video, you found it helpful, please like it. Subscribe to our channel, and have a look through. I'll, I'll also link to our Nespresso playlist at the end of this video and also another relevant video for you. So check those out uh, and you can learn much more about how to use your machine.